On the night of March 27, 1999, Lieutenant Column Darrell Zelko of the United States Air Force 49th Fighter Wing was flying a mission over Serbia, part of NATO's Operation Allied Force. His target? A heavily fortified enemy command center near Belgrade. His aircraft? The legendary F-117A Nighthawk, the world's first stealth fighter. Designed to be invisible to radar, the Nighthawk was the crown jewel of stealth technology. Zelko, flying solo without any support aircraft that night, trusted the F-117A's capabilities to evade detection. But below, in the darkness of the Serbian countryside, something was waiting. Commanding the defense was Lieutenant Colonel Zoltan Dani, a veteran of the Yugoslav Air Defense Forces. Dani knew the terrain well, and he wasn't intimidated by the might of NATO. His weapon of choice? A Soviet-era S-125 Neva missile system, obsolete by modern standards, but still deadly in the right hands. The S-125, designed in the 1960s, was no match for the most advanced stealth aircraft of its time, but that wouldn't stop Danny from trying. With Zelko approaching, Danny's battery locked onto the Nighthawk. It was a game of cat and mouse in the deadly silence of the night. Zelko, flying at 12,000 feet, was unaware that he had been spotted. The F-117A's radar-absorbing coatings and low-radar cross-section made it nearly invisible to most tracking systems. But the S-125, though outdated, had one advantage. Its radar was optimized for targeting low-flying aircraft, and the Nighthawk, despite its stealth, was still detectable under certain conditions. For a brief moment, Zelko felt a sense of calm. The mission was on track. But then, a warning light flashed on his dashboard. An incoming missile. The missile shot into the night air, its warhead aimed squarely at the stealth fighter. Zelko had mere seconds to react. Using every ounce of skill, Zelko deployed flares and attempted evasive maneuvers. But it was too late. In that moment, the unthinkable happened. The F-117A was hit, and Lieutenant Colum Darrell Zelko's aircraft plunged into the Serbian countryside, the first F-171 to be shot down in combat. Zelko survived the crash, and in the end, he was rescued by NATO forces. But the mission, along with the myth of the Nighthawk's invincibility, was shattered. The downing of the F-117A would become one of the most talked-about moments of the conflict, and a testament to the deadly potential of older technologies when used with precision and skill. Lieutenant Colonel Zoltan Danny and his missile battery had proven something that many had thought impossible, that even the most advanced stealth technology was not invulnerable. March 27, 1999 The night that reminded the world that in war, there are no guarantees.